Here we are at the University of Tulsa, Oklahoma's own Ivy League school. TU is a private research institution and the nation's smallest Division I athletic program. The university prides itself on student support and success. In fact, TU is so confident in its outcomes that it offers a job placement guarantee to all undergraduates. That's incredible. Just three miles from Tulsa's downtown Art Deco district and situated on historic Route 66, students have quick access to concert venues, art galleries, coffee houses, fun restaurants, theaters, shops, and much more. I'm your host, Alex Boylan, and during the next half hour, we're gonna introduce you to the beautiful TU campus, state-of-the-art facilities, a K-9 ambassador, and plenty of current students who love their golden hurricane home. These young innovators are ready to share their journeys on the road to becoming attorneys, entrepreneurs, filmmakers, and engineers. I can't wait to hear their stories. Welcome to the University of Tulsa and Rain King. This is the College Tour. Hold on, because we're about to meet TU's biggest fan. Freddie is a chemical engineering senior from Van Buren, Arkansas. He's minoring in history, math, and biomedical engineering. Freddie never misses a Golden Hurricane game or a chance to hang out with TU's canine ambassador, Golden. You're up, Freddie. Take it away. Thanks for that, Alex. Hey, everyone. Upon weighing my options for colleges, the most important considerations for me were places with a real sense of belonging, community, prestige, and even spirit. Upon visiting the University of Tulsa, I knew this was the one. When I first toured TU, I learned we are very big on traditions. At the beginning of our freshman year, we run through the fountains at the end of our campus-wide glow-in-the-dark scavenger hunt. This signifies the watershed moment that we are all experiencing. As a freshman class, we then stormed the field during our first home football game. game day. One of my favorite memories is President Carson paying for students to attend the ESPN College Game Day, Cincinnati versus Tulsa. Our small student group rivaled their entire stadium in energy and moves. Naturally, we also take homecoming very seriously with a bonfire that can supposedly be seen from space. I also have to mention our most recent and my personal favorite tradition, Golden. Whenever I'm near her office on campus, I always find an excuse to go see her. Just as we begin our college career with a tradition, we fittingly end it with another. After a senior's last final exam, they head to Bayless Plaza to ring the Kindle bell. This tradition has been going on for many, many years and has become such a big deal that the university throws a final bell party for all graduating seniors. But do not ring the bell before your last final. Rumor has it, if you do, you won't graduate. When I was in high school, I did not care about school traditions or athletics. Now, I'm addicted to them. The passionate and engaging community of TU has given me the most amazing college experience ever. Rain Kane, Alex. Yes, so much of college life is about those traditions and shared experiences. TU is over 125 years old and its traditions go back generations. Gathering for the homecoming pep rally and ringing the Kendall bell are moments students here in Tulsa will never forget. Rain Kane, Freddie, take care. It's time to get fit with exercise and sports science junior Takari from Atoka, Oklahoma. For fields like engineering and health science, doing is just as important as learning. Luckily, Dakari knew what she wanted from a university and found an engaging, hands-on program at TU that brings her major to life. Your turn, Dakari. Thanks, Alex. When I first started my college search, I knew I wanted to attend a small university with a close-knit environment that was both fun and academically driven. Luckily for me, the University of Tulsa checks off all of those boxes. I came to TU with the intent of getting the most out of my college experience. I wanted to engage with my peers and take advantage of the networking opportunities Tulsa has to offer. Tulsa introduces you to many alumni that have been in your exact shoes and have thrived in your major. I'm a super hands-on learner and TU has many things that help bring learning to life. 
The labs are reflections of real-life scenarios that help translate to success in the workplace. As an exercise sports science major, in the human anatomy lab, we worked with models of the human body, dissected a cat, and labeled all of the body parts. In the human anatomy kinesiology lab, we went in person to the Collins Fitness Center on campus to perform exercises as a class. We then discussed how every individual muscle and bone works together to complete that exercise. I'm also pretty involved on campus because I believe that participating outside of the classroom is another way to further my knowledge, education, and experiences. I'm a part of the Association of Black Collegians Club, a cheerleader on the Spirit Squad, and an administrative assistant for the men's soccer team. You experience hands-on learning here that opens so many doors for your future. I never thought I would gain the knowledge I've gained thus far at the University of Tulsa. I can happily say I'm so glad I chose to you. Back over to you, Alex. Thanks to Kari. I'm so glad to hear the University of Tulsa encourages students to look beyond the traditional classroom setting and put what they learn into practice as they prepare for rewarding careers. This kind of approach is sure to make Dakari a fantastic athletic trainer someday. Thanks again. It's time to meet David, a biology major who's minoring in media studies. David came to Tulsa from Cypress, Texas, and found new friends in the student organizations at TU. He's gonna walk us through some of the offerings on campus, as well as clubs and activities he's enjoying in between classes. You're on, David. Thanks for the intro, Alex, and welcome to everyone watching. Before coming to college, I was homeschooled for my entire life, aside from preschool. Now, contrary to the stereotypes, I did have a few friend groups and activities throughout the week, ranging from debate to art. But as soon as I got to college, I knew I wanted to remain involved. And that's where the University of Tulsa stepped in. TU showed me just how invested they were in student activities by showcasing the diversity of clubs on campus. Through our yearly activities fair, held during the first week of classes, each of our student clubs brings a table out to the old U and they show off what they do and how our freshman class can get involved. That's how I got involved with TUTV, peer mentors, and the university ambassadors. Each of these organizations gave me the opportunity to get involved with fun live streams every semester, weekly campus tours with prospective students, some awesome mentorship activities during orientation, and weekly news shows focused on events both in Tulsa and around the nation. Here at TU, you can get involved in anything. Our 200 total student organizations have focuses ranging from ice skating to scuba diving to animal welfare. But what's even more awesome is if you and a couple of friends have a common passion, you can establish your own club on campus and receive funding from our student association. TU's student organizations contributed more to my learning than I ever thought possible. I've been able to pursue my passions for media while remaining involved in student engagement and my focus in biology. So while it's still really important to focus on your classes, getting involved in student life is going to grow you as a person and not just your knowledge base. Thanks so much for the time, Alex. Now back to you. Wow, so many ways to get involved and explore opportunities. David found his fit at TU, and lots of students have started their own clubs after making connections on campus. Organizations offer so many ways to enjoy college life. Thanks for sharing your favorite ones with us, David. Take care. Let's check in with Bryce, a film studies and creative writing sophomore who grew up in nearby Kellyville, Oklahoma. Even though his hometown is less than an hour's drive away, Bryce says he's learned a lot about Tulsa since attending TU and excited to share some of his favorite hangouts and experiences with us. Let's get rolling, Bryce. Thank you so much, Alex. Hello, everyone. When it comes to deciding what college to attend, there are a number of factors to consider. Whether it be how close you are to home, the on-campus community, or the amount of opportunities the school has to offer, everyone has something they have to have at their dream college. In my case, I wanted to go to school somewhere I could always find something to do. And what better place than the University of Tulsa? Having grown up in the Tulsa area, I knew I would always have something to do. But I didn't quite realize how much there was to do until I was actually living in the city. With places like the Mother Road Market, I'm constantly finding new places to explore right next to campus. Being a film student, my favorite places to hang out in Tulsa are the Admiral Twin or Circle Cinema, two historic movie theaters that have been featured in films like The Outsiders and used for various events and screenings. 
Even if movies aren't your thing, there are a ton of places across Tulsa like The Gathering Place or Tulsa Zoo to keep you entertained. The best part about having these places around campus is how easy the University of Tulsa makes it to get involved. The University works closely with the organizations in the area to offer TU students internships. Students use the skills they're developing in the classroom to get early experience in their fields. I've just made it through my first year at the University of Tulsa and I've still got a lot to learn. Thanks to TU and its wonderful faculty, I'm on the right path to succeeding as a filmmaker. Thanks everyone. Back to you, Alex. And cut. What a great city for an aspiring filmmaker. And here's a fun fact. Writer Essie Hinton wrote the novel The Outsiders while she was a high school student just a few blocks from where I'm standing right now. And the book was published while she was a freshman at TU. We wish you the same success, Bryce. Thanks for sharing your story. Let's talk about TU's wraparound student support with Junior Madison from St. Louis, Missouri. She's a computer science and cybersecurity major with a minor in math. The University of Tulsa has invested in student success coaches and other staffers who shepherd undergraduates through a sometimes daunting journey. Show us the way, Madison. y'all and thank you for the fantastic introduction Alex. Picking a college was a daunting task for me and balancing academics, cost, community, and simply finding a place that felt like home was important to me. I decided on the University of Tulsa and fell in love with this small university. With TU's renowned engineering and natural sciences department, small class sizes, amicable professors, and general uplifting atmosphere, I knew this was the perfect fit for me. I took full advantage of TU's tutoring center. The peer tutors really helped me when I was struggling in a class and they explained things to me in an easy to digest manner which allowed me to excel. The career development office prepared me with tips and tricks to ace an interview with a Fortune 500 company and help me to put my best foot forward. With student success coaches, peer mentors, and career and financial wellness coaches, students always feel supported and prepared for life after college. Also, the mental health resources available on campus make it easy to see how much TU cares about its students and their well-being. Because of the support I received here at TU, I was able to score an internship at a Fortune 500 company as a sophomore, get involved on campus, and make memories for a lifetime. I'll throw it back to you, Alex. Internships as sophomores, that's incredible. It's all part of TU's goal to make sure students are able to get a great job in their field or admitted to a top-notch graduate school after completing their bachelor's degree. We can't wait to see where you land, Madison. Thanks again for sharing your story. We're peeking into the future with our next student, Bryce, a data-driven physics major and math minor. Bryce is a junior from Overland Park, Kansas, and enjoys being a part of the Tulsa Undergraduate Research Challenge here at TU, where students can begin working in labs with expert faculty as early as their freshman year. Take it away, Bryce. Thanks for the introduction, Alex. Ever since I was young, I've been drawn towards the fields of math and science. My mom would tell me how I would constantly come to her with a list of colleges I wanted to attend when I was only in elementary school. I know that ambitious kid would be proud today with all of the opportunities I've had at the University of Tulsa. After becoming acclimated with the university, I was eager to get involved with as many things as I could. I joined Greek life, physics clubs, and got involved with solar cell research with one of my professors. I was amazed with how easy it was to get involved with research here. All I had to do was send an email and the rest fell right into place. Since then, I've been able to work under Dr. Hari, who puts my success as a student over just about everything else. I've gotten experience in the lab and advice for presenting research, as well as getting involved in the Tulsa Undergraduate Research Challenge that the university supports, and even leading me to work with students and other majors on a business plan for technology that has been researched right here at the university. The experiences I've had have taught me how the real world research process works, from conception to a business. I never would have been able to gain the knowledge I have now without the help from my professors and the countless opportunities I've come across at this school. I know that I'll be able to do great things in the future, thanks to the University of Tulsa. Thank you for listening to my story and take it back, Alex.
Wow, solar cell research plus business acumen equals a successful combination for this young entrepreneur. TU gives students the resources to excel in many career fields. I'm pretty sure we'll be hearing more about this project in the years to come. Great job, thanks again, Bryce. Next up is Haley from Durant, Oklahoma. She's an exercise and sports science junior with a minor in early intervention. Haley is a D1 athlete and is pretty competitive in the classroom too. About one in nine TU students is a collegiate athlete and the teams regularly top their conference in GPA. Pitch in to you, Haley. Thanks for the intro, Alex. Hey, everybody. I've been coming to the University of Tulsa campus ever since my eighth grade year, and I committed to play softball here my sophomore year of high school. As an Oklahoma girl, attending TU meant staying close to home while also pursuing the highest level of athletics and academics. The close-knit support surrounding this university is like no other. In any football, soccer, basketball, or softball game, you know there will always be a crowd. Students get into all sporting events for free just by showing their student ID. Pretty sweet deal if you ask me. The school spirit is contagious and it has shaped my college experience in the best way. Turn on a Tulsa football game and you'll see me sitting front row, probably shouting out our famous Rain Kane. As a student athlete, TU provides resources to help us reach our full potential. We have amazing strength coaches in the weight room, athletic trainers in the training room, and our advisors in the academic center, CASE. TU also prepares students to connect with sports through student manager opportunities with different internships in various areas of the sports world. The University of Tulsa has provided even more opportunities to get involved in my sport, like the organization's Fellowship of Christian Athletes and the Student Athlete Advisory Committee. If you were to ask me my favorite part, it would be the memories, friendships, and experiences that will last a lifetime. That's all from me, everybody. Throwing it back to you, Alex. And as always, Rain Kane. You hit that one out of the park, Haley. TU student athletes build character on and off the field, and they share their excitement and enthusiasm with their friends and classmates. TU tops it off with free admission to all sporting events for all students. Thanks for the tip, Haley. Take care. Next up is Sing Ming, who's majoring in finance and minoring in economics. As a senior from Houston, Texas, he's had a few years to make friends, but it's not always easy to build a support network. Luckily, TU has terrific faculty, staff, and students who want to make everyone feel welcome and part of the Golden Hurricane family. Tell us all about it, Sing Ming. Thanks, Alex. Being from Houston, I'm a big Texas boy and thought I would stay local for college. However, the University of Tulsa was the first school I applied to where I felt wanted and cared for, especially by my admissions counselor. Entering a new school made it easy to feel lonely. So when friends from my campus ministry and my peer mentor intentionally reached out to me, I felt very loved. I truly enjoy building relationships with others and I desired to give back to the TU community. Though I originally wanted to be a peer mentor, I realized being a resident assistant or RA gave me the opportunity to see my residents consistently while being a mentor and friend. My number one goal at John Maybe Hall was to ensure my residents knew they were loved and seen, and I took action by meeting with residents one-on-one, -on -one, hosting fun hall programs bi-weekly, and gladly answering questions. Being an RA has been one of the most rewarding experiences of my life, as I get to witness my residents becoming friends with each other, and I've made some incredible friends who will be RAs this year. The University of Tulsa wants each resident to have a great experience. One example of this is hall government events, from dances to pool tournaments, often with free food. TU also emphasizes safety in residence halls. Through multi-layered security systems to enter, RAs doing duty rounds nightly, and campus police only being a phone call away. Living on campus at TU will provide lifelong memories through friendships and the RA support. What I've learned since being here is that the college experience is so much more fulfilling when it's centered on caring for others. Well, I've got to go. Alex, what's next? Thank you, Sing Ming. TU's caring campus is such a wonderful place for students to be themselves while still feeling like they're part of a bigger community. 
Living in the residence hall is a uniquely collegiate experience, and TU makes it easy to feel at home. You're a true blue friend, Singming. Thanks again. Okay, it's time to meet Asa, a senior from Springfield, Missouri. Asa is a peer mentor, a political science and chemistry double major, and is headed to law school after graduation. With so many interests, he is the perfect person to explain to use academic flexibility. Let's go, Asa. Thanks, Alex, and hello, everyone. When I first came to the University of Tulsa, I had no idea what I wanted to study. What I did know is that I had a variety of interests in different fields, including the sciences and liberal arts, and that I wanted to go to law school after graduating. I love that at the University of Tulsa, I was able to start out by picking a menagerie of courses that interested me. I'm currently finishing my degrees in chemistry and political science with much support from my faculty and friends. I decided on political science in my first year, and as I delved deeper into the sciences, I smoothly added chemistry going into my second year. TU's double major programming makes the time commitment from the extra coursework far more manageable and encourages overlap between the majors wherever possible, allowing me to still have extra time to take courses in other niches, such as acoustic guitar and cooking. My professors have provided excellent assistance in determining coursework, areas of research, and even extracurriculars that fall within my specific studies. My friends especially have continued to be of great support and I'm grateful to share a collaborative and supportive community of peers from all the various fields. This community is why I chose TU in the first place, and my friends continue to help me find the kind of impact that I want to have on the world. To me, my college education has been about discovering what I am passionate about and how to weave that into a career. Thanks for listening. Back to you, Alex. What an amazing bunch of talents and interests, Asa. And with such support from your TU family, you will be ready for big things. The interdisciplinary collaboration that happens between the various colleges and academic departments at TU makes it easy for students to pursue their passions. Thanks, Asa. Let's hear about a very special program called Make a Difference Engineering, or MADE at TU for short. Mechanical engineering senior Miranda from Fayetteville, Arkansas was drawn to Tulsa because of the emphasis on service learning and on giving your time and talents to help others. It's all you, Miranda. Thank you so much, Alex. What's up, everybody? I had no idea I wanted to be an engineer when I applied to college. I knew I liked math and talking to people. The University of Tulsa quickly cemented itself as my dream university for more than just its gorgeous architecture. From big opportunities in a tight-knit collaborative community and hands-on classes, I knew that here I could be more than an engineer. The combination of a liberal arts curriculum at a research university has allowed me to pursue all of my passions. I'm the president of the Society of Women Engineers and co-founder and vice president of the Biomedical Engineering Society. I've also written for our campus newspaper and participated in theater productions. I've utilized these soft skills as a project leader in Made at TU since my freshman year. Made is a program where students, as a team, take a product from brainstorming and research to manufacturing and delivery for a child with a disability in the Tulsa community. At MADE, the dedication of your time matters as you create a no-cost-to-the-family therapy device such as a tricycle or a sensory console. You're getting real-world experience as you bring our campus closer to the community, make dreams come true, and instill confidence and capability in a child. I was able to land two incredible internships with a world-class medical device company because of my MADE experiences. This program made me realize that what matters to me is improving and saving lives. The first time I saw our customer interact with our product, I cried with her mom as her daughter rode a bike for the first time. Our time on these projects is literally changing lives. Now let's go make a difference, Alex. You and the other Made at TU students are amazing, Miranda. It feels so good to give back to your community, and college allows you to find those places where you really want to make a difference. I love that students here at Tulsa are discovering that life is about more than grades and parties. Thank you for sharing your story, Miranda. That was incredible. 
All right, y'all, what a fabulous time we've had here at the University of Tulsa. From the freshmen storming Skelly Field at their first home football game, to when they ring the Kendall Bell after their last final exam. TU provides an unparalleled college experience. The faculty rival those at Ivy League schools. The alumni network is out of this world. The Success Center is there for students every step of the way. And the campus is unbelievable. I'm so grateful for all the members of the Golden Hurricane family who shared their stories with us. TU is a gem just waiting for you to discover it. Take care, everyone.